Hey guys, thanks for checking out the bullet points again. Um, big special thanks to uh, Silencer Shop uh, who brought Rugged Suppressors out for us to do a shoot. We've got Michael from Rugged Suppressors which is going to go over their brand new Razor 762. Now, I know that you guys have made a 762 in the past, which was the Surge 762. The Surge 762, and that was your first silencer out, correct? It was. It was a fully modular uh, 762 uh, rifle suppressor. Um, we wanted to do something a little bit different and do a dedicated um, 762 can that was shorter and lighter, that exhibited all the same strengths um, that the Surge had. So it's not just a Gen 2, it's a completely redesigned suppressor. Exactly. Very cool. Okay, well, tell us a little bit about it. As far as the Razor 7.62 goes, it shares some of the same features as the um, Surge 7.62. Um, removable end caps, uh, which will be available in 5.56 as well, um, in case you're running on a uh, 5.56 host. So let me get this right. You can take this suppressor, you can put it on your 300 Blackout, or your Remington 700 and 308, whatever, yep. right? Run 7.62 through it all day long, switch out the end cap, to a 5.56 and put it on your AR. Exactly. That is insanely cool. Yep. That is Absolutely. insanely cool. And I know that with uh, some suppressors, there's a little bit of a uh, sound increase if you run a smaller caliber, caliber round through a larger caliber rated suppressor. So this cuts down on that. It does. It gives you a, uh, it gives you a slight advantage um, over running a 7.62 end cap. Very cool, very cool. Okay, tell us, uh, tell us a little bit about the, the length and weight and everything. So the weight is 15.3 ounces. Okay. Um, it's got a full Stellite stack and comes in at 6.4 inches in length. So um, it's shorter, it's lighter, uh, yet it still can handle 300 rum. It's full auto rated and it's also belt fed rated. That is insanely cool. So the, uh, the experience I've had with suppressors in the past is, um, you know, when I'm shooting them, a lot of times somebody will give you a 30 round magazine and they'll say, don't go rapid fire or stop after 30. Uh, not the case with this. Not at all. You can just run this thing all you day. Can. You don't have to worry about it overheating, exploding on <clears> you. <throat> I mean, that so is awesome. that we, we basically designed it so that you can run it as hard as you want. That is insanely cool. And I saw with your uh, previous 7.62, the Surge, a torture test on that where the gun actually failed and cooked off around prior to the suppressor breaking <laughs> Absolutely. down. Absolutely. That is so cool. So, man, I'm really excited about this. And we've got a special surprise. Uh, you said it's belt rated, right? It is. I think we're going to have some fun with the 240 here.
going through 200 rounds belt fed in less than a minute. I put another 75-ish through it uh, without letting it cool down much. You probably saw on the first speed, it was actually getting a little orange there. And no failure, it's as quiet as it was for the first round. Multi-caliber, this thing is stupid cool. I mean, this is seriously one of the coolest pressures, I mean, the coolest pressure I've ever seen. So rugged, <laughs> rugged suppressors did a really, really good job on this thing. It is absolutely amazing, and everything we put it through is held up, including the 240. Awesome, awesome piece of it. All right, guys. Well, we just got done firing the uh, Razor 762 by uh, Rugged Suppressors, and God, is that thing incredible! Uh, thank you again to Silencer Shop for putting this whole thing together. If you guys are interested in owning one of these yourself, it's actually a lot easier than you think. Um, go on silencershop.com and just check out. They have a whole thing that tells you what states you can own them in and the different things like that. You can order them and they'll ship them to your local class three FFL. So if you want something like this, check them out online. But Rugged Suppressors did a fantastic job with this thing, man. I mean, this razor was unbelievable. We ran 300 blackout, we ran 556 five, tracers, we did full auto in all of those. And then if that wasn't enough, we took it off and we threw it on an M240 and ran several hundred rounds through it full auto. It was unbelievable, man. I was, honestly, I was kind of expecting it to break apart or have chunks come <laughs> off of it or something. I mean, it was nuts. I, I could not believe how well that thing held up. So kudos to you guys, man. Uh, Rugged Suppressors did a really, really good job with that. I highly recommend you check one out. Um, if you got a buddy that has one or something, take a look at it. If not, just grab one, man. They're insanely cool. So what's the MSRP on something like that? MSRP is 950. 950. So basically 300 on down, right? How many, how many calibers can you run out of So that? three, I mean, it's, it's rated to 300 drum right? all the way down. That's incredible. So one silencer fits on a variety of different guns, right? And it's belt fed rated. That's just unbelievable. Again, I told you guys before, I've seen a lot of suppressors that, you know, you don't want to run more than 30 rounds through because you're worried about it cooking off or breaking apart on you. This thing was absolutely unbelievable and I, I cannot stress enough the torture we put this to and it just kept on ticking. So you guys did an awesome job. Thanks again, Michael, for having us out. I man. appreciate it. Really appreciate it. And we'll look forward to seeing a lot more of you guys. Excellent.